it's like it's like dancing in a mirror. I'm a junk in autumn. Seems so misery, yeah, yeah. I'm a drunken hearted man, and my life seems so misery, yeah. And if I could only change my way of living, oh, it would mean so much to me. I've been drunk and I've been living, yeah, yeah. Ever since I left my mother's home, I've been drunk and I've been driven, yeah. Ever since I left my mother's home, and I can't find no reason why I don't leave no good woman alone. I'm a drunk and hearted man. I'm a drunken hearted man, yeah, 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 yeah. I'm a drunken hearted man, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm a drunken hearted man, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm a drunken hearted man. And if I could only change my way of living, uh, it would mean so much to me. <laughs> <laughs> Who are we hanging out with? Piper Davis. How are you doing? Good. Yeah. Thanks. Yes. Are you feeling ready for Toronto? What's coming up for you? Oh, we're going to go to North by Northeast. So, yeah, I'm feeling ready. Well, I, almost ready, I guess. <laughs> so what's the best case scenario for something like this? It can go one of two ways. Nothing can happen or something amazing can happen. Uh, best case scenario, you get a label, you get on someone's opening tour maybe. Who would um, you want to open for? Who's the dream band? I love Jamie Lydell. He's amazing. Every time he comes to town I see him. I, you know, I don't care. I'd love to open for anyone. I want to go on tour. Tell me about your um, Red Bull story and Twitter. Oh, Red Bull. Well, Red Bull's been great. I went to the Red Bull Music Academy in, uh, in Barcelona last year. So that was in itself a pretty high budget and amazing trip. And I, I got on Twitter just a few months ago. Someone told me to. And I, you know, after being in there a couple of weeks, I Twittered that I was going to Mexico City to record with a friend of mine, Natalia Lafricade. <laughs> a uh, musician down there that I met in Barcelona and Red Bull said we saw on your Twitter and we'll pay for it so yeah it's your kinda... Twitter I need a pony yeah <laughs> <laughs> you know, a lot of people think of Red Bull they think of like partying and late nights but the Red Bull Academy is actually like a really serious music school you have to go through quite an application to get in I know that really I mean I met some really incredible people it's not all the time that that people in in this industry are totally down to earth what about your music? A lot of old school, a lot of samples. What are you, what are you trying to say? I started making music. I mean, I used to throw raves back in a long time ago, back in the rave era. Musically, I think definitely that kind of driving bass and drums stuck in my brain, and I, I was really into soul music after that for a long time and old funk records and just really basic Pro Tools abilities. Yeah. <laughs> you know, I started making music not really knowing what it was going to sound like and it came out sounding the way it does. If you wouldn't walk, take apart my bike. Do you ever feel like you were born in the wrong time? Like if there was a time that you could travel back to and totally live it up, when would it be? Oh, my sister always thought I belonged in the 70s. I don't know. I love to dance. Well, what is it about the Vancouver flavor? We're, we're sitting here at Crab Park. There's industrial Vancouver over there. There's a pile of puke right there. <laughs> what about this moment are you going to take to the T-Dot? Well, Vancouver's a laid-back place. I feel like my music and my personality, I'm a little bit on the laid-back side. I'm not, I, maybe that'll change. I don't think so. I think, uh, I think, you know, there's a little bit of that Vancouver sort of attitude in it. Yeah. Or non-attitude, I would say. <laughs> I'm going to drink a shitload of coffee and come back super aggro and talk really, really fast. <laughs> and wear yeah. Lots of black like George Strombolopoulos. Yes, 
Exactly. exactly. Can we edit that out? <laughs> <laughs> we'll be back. Thanks. Thanks a lot. Nice talking to you. You too.